Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here, and in this video, we'll be doing a quick speed test comparison of the newly launched Redmi Note 11 with the last year's Redmi Note 10. So let's just go to the uh, settings first and uh, see these two devices. You can see here Redmi Note 11 and Redmi Note 10. So one of the major differences is that uh, this device, the Redmi Note 11, comes with a MIUI 13 out of the box, while this is MIUI 12.5. Now both are running on Android. Uh, 11 and that's uh, kind of disappointing for a phone launched in 2022 uh, to come with still uh, android 11 but uh, keeping things aside now uh, one important aspect is that uh, this is a uh, qualcomm snapdragon 680 while uh, the uh, redmi note 10 is the qualcomm snapdragon 678 launched last year now is the 680 an upgrade over 678 uh, on paper or on numbers uh, 680 is definitely better than the 678 but then um, is it really a uh, better processor uh, not really actually uh, while the snapdragon 680 is a 6 nanometer process uh, uh, the snapdragon 678 has a 11 nanometer processor uh, the efficiency is definitely better on the 680 so battery will be definitely better it is a 2.4 gigahertz uh, clock speed while this is 2.2 gigahertz clock speed that's the max clock speed but things change uh, when it comes to gpu here we have the adreno 610 uh, gpu while uh, on the redmi note uh, 10 we have the adreno 612 gpu that's slightly superior actually and uh, you also get uh, the qualcomm's cryos 265 cores on uh, the redmi note uh, 11 with the snapdragon 680 while this is uh, a snapdragon's uh, uh, cryo 460 cores on the redmi note 10 with uh, the snapdragon 678 so while the 680 seems like a upgrade over the 678 it's definitely not a major upgrade there are few things that are better on the 680 while there are few things that are better on the 678 so let's see which of these perform better uh, before starting the test we let you know that this is a almost 10 year old device which has received multiple updates to the 12.5 version so that might have slowed down a bit. Now both of these devices have the AMOLED display. Here we have a 90 hertz AMOLED display. Uh, the 680 supports 90 hertz, while the 678 has standard 60 hertz. So that's the, the differences here. So we'll just uh, clear off all the background apps here. Uh, so once again, let's just clear off. So you can see here both of uh, the devices are cleared off all the background apps. So let's just. Uh, connect to the same network as well so we'll also uh, see the network connections on both the devices so you can see here both are connected to the same wi-fi network both are in airplane mode as well so let's just uh, start the test so we'll clear off all the background apps once again so there you go so redmi note uh, 10 versus redmi note 11 so let's start with asphalt 9 so we have enabled the game turbo mode on both the devices so let's uh, uh, see which of these uh, devices opens games faster whether it's a redmi note uh, 10 or the red new redmi note 11 so let's wait for this to finish so you can see here redmi note 11 was slightly faster uh, not by a huge margin but slightly it was faster uh, next let's go to uh, bgmi so let's see which of these uh, devices opens BGMI faster. So Note uh, 10 has taken the lead. In fact, Red Redmi Note 10 has opened the game faster than the Note 11. So as I said before, there isn't much of a difference between 680 and 678. So next is Play Store. Uh, Note uh, 11 is uh, faster. Chrome browser. So Note 11 is faster. Facebook, uh, probably almost same time I would say. Twitter, uh, you can see that Redmi Note uh, 10 is faster. Instagram, fractionally faster is uh, the Note 11. Spotify, Uh, it was slightly faster on initially it was faster but uh, the loading was faster on the note 11 uh, next is amazon again note 10 was slightly faster i would say flipkart uh, note 11 was faster so here you can see that uh, note uh, 11 was faster settings again note uh, 11 was faster 
again note 11 was faster again note 11 is faster camera again note 11 is faster this is taking a lot of time to open the camera so you can see here that's one of the uh, issues now finally maps so you can see that again note uh, 11 is faster here so let's uh, just uh, test the memory management also so you can see that uh, while there is a definitely an improvement in speeds compared to the note uh, 10 but you have to also consider that note 10 was a slightly older device so that has become a bit slow over a period of time uh, again uh, processor wise there isn't uh, much of a difference i would say uh, next uh, is the memory management of these two devices let's open the apps in the reverse order so it's available in the memory camera available uh, gmail uh, is available youtube is available settings uh, again uh, both are available file manager is available flipkart uh, is reloaded on the note 10 while it's available on the note 11 amazon again available on the note 10 it's reloaded on the note uh, i mean uh, reloaded on the note 10 available on the note 11 spotify is again available on the note uh, uh, 11 instagram is again available Twitter available, Facebook is uh, again uh, reloaded on the Note 10, Chrome browser is available. So what you can see is that memory management seems to have uh, drastically improved over uh, the uh, previous one, uh, the MIUI 12.5 and compared to the MIUI 13. So this is available on both the devices. Now BGMI, BGMI is retained on uh, uh, the Redmi Note 11. but uh, it's uh, reloaded on the redmi note 10 so note 11 uh, has been uh, doing uh, really better in terms of memory management so let's just uh, finish off this loading here so here we finish now final game uh, is asphalt 9 so asphalt 9 is uh, reloaded on both the devices so what you can see is uh, the MIUI 13 definitely brings in better memory management uh, on the Redmi Note uh, 11 compared to the Redmi Note 10. So uh, memory management has definitely been improved on this uh, device. While uh, the opening of apps there was slight difference uh, with the Redmi Note 10 and the Redmi Note 11, the Note 11 being the winner. So that was our speed test comparison of these two devices. So while there isn't a major difference in terms of uh, improvement, in terms of speed, uh, the uh, performance uh, or rather the memory management has been improved with MIUI 30. Next, let's uh, see uh, the network speed. So we have the speed test application as well. So let's just connect uh, both the devices to the same server. So you can see here both are connected to the same server. And once again, both are in same uh, uh, network connections as well. Again, same uh, set of uh, connections. So let's just start the, uh, the speed test here. So it's going neck to neck, almost similar performance. In fact, right now, uh, so there you go. You can see that uh, speed was slightly better on the uh, Redmi Note uh, 11. Now download speed seems to be better right now on the Redmi Note 10 or rather the upload speed. So there you go. So that's the speed test we'll do once again. So 66, 48 and 66. Uh, 42 so uh, quite similar actually uh, while the uh, download speed was slightly better on the redmi note 11 now uh, we'll do this once again so once again download speed was better on the uh, redmi note 11 and now you can see that upload see speed seems to be better on the uh, redmi note 11 so you can see that there is definitely an improvement in the uh, speed uh, both the devices connected to the same wi-fi network so th this is uh, just an uh, indicative speed test this is not a very accurate test uh, there are a lot of criteria which uh, plays a role in the op app opening time and also the memory management so this is just to give you an idea about how the performance is how the response time is how the memory management is and also how the network speeds are so that is our speed test comparison of the Redmi Note 10 versus Redmi Note 11. So hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit the red subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.